Hello, I'm Terry McCann with the second in my five-part series titled An Introduction to Lean Concepts. After a brief history of lean in part one, today we look at the question, what is lean? I suggest you pause this presentation and quickly jot down, very briefly, your own definition to answer the question, what is lean? That will help you evaluate the rest of this presentation as it agrees with or varies from your own existing understanding. So press pause and answer the question, what is lean? Do that now. Here is my working definition that I will discuss over the rest of this series. Lean is a methodology for making improvements in the production of value as defined by the customer by motivating and engaging the workforce to eliminate waste for ever greater efficiency and effectiveness in the production of that value. Put simplistically, lean is about striving to produce more with less. The rest of this presentation teases out this definition and looks at some foundational concepts and tools for achieving this goal. There is an underlying philosophical element to lean, but it is primarily practical. That is why it is a methodology. The underlying philosophy is that you can always make something better and you can always make the process more effective and efficient. We will never reach perfection, but we can always move further along the road to that ideal state. So lean is a methodology for making improvements, but improvements in what? Lean is a methodology for making improvements in the production of value. Lean originated with the production and manufacture of automobiles, but lean has a place in every industry manufacturing, logistics, banking, retail, information technology and computer software, non-profit organizations and government departments as well. Regardless of its type, every organization that serves or sells produces value. It is the object of lean to continually improve the process that produces that value. Lean then is a methodology for making improvements in the production of value, but who decides what is of value? If you take your customers away, your business will cease to exist. The first step in a lean initiative is to identify your customers and what they want and value and are willing to pay for. In a lean organization, everything you do is focused on providing your customers with what they value and eliminating as much as possible of what they do not value and are not willing to pay for. Put differently, no matter how valuable or necessary you may consider some artifact or activity to be, if the customer is not willing to pay for it, then it has no value in the lean sense of the word. The importance of this distinction will be more apparent later on when we look at value added processes and value stream mapping. A foundational principle of the Toyota production system, TPS, is respect for people. Peter Drucker, a management guru who is not normally associated with lean, is famous for his adage, culture eats strategy for breakfast. A culture of respect for people is essential for lean to be successful. It is the workforce, the people, both workers and managers, in whom the lean culture subsists. Machines don't have a culture, only people do. In a lean organization, people are always respected as more important than machines. This is not traditionally true in most non-lean Western businesses and corporations, where hugely expensive equipment may well be more valued than the people who operate these assets. Lean, then, is a methodology for making improvements in the production of value as defined by the customer by motivating and engaging the workforce. But to do what? by motivating and engaging the workforce to eliminate waste. The concept of waste 
is a major element in the lean methodology and is deserving of its own presentation. Take a break and then move on to view the next presentation in the Introduction to Lean Concepts series entitled, What is Waste? I'm Terry McCann. If you have questions or comments regarding this presentation, send an email to terry.mccann at tcmc-qms.ca terry.mccann at tcmc-qms.ca